All right, now we're at match 19 of the FFT Arena Special Rules AI Tournament. Uh, this is a loser semifinals, so we're down to the final four, two of which are Kapala on top and Dr. Cavallo on the bottom. All right, so Atsuro the Mystic Knight, Mugen the Mystic Knight, Yuko the Priest, Beatrice the Time Mage, and for Dr. Cavallo, we got Z Zaina the Geomancer, Ozma the Paladin, Sarah the Priest, and Olive the Chemist. Uh, this is actually a bit of a rematch of some sort um, from the first round, uh, where Kapala defeated Dr. Cavallo early on in the winner's um, side bracket. Now, how will, now how will they contend in losers? Let's see. We are going to be heading off to, if I can pull up the maps really quick, here we go. First off, we're going to be going to map 40, the Gug Slums. Here we go. Good luck to the two of you. Strike hits the Mystic Knight. All right, so Paul gets haste on all four of his um on on all four of his troops here. Nice little whack there. The chemist will get mowed down, but he does have re raise though. So it will be coming up. So it will be expiring very shortly. He uses up the high potion and then wisely runs back. Because of a swarm. A little bit of brave up. And MP Switch did eat, eat a hit as well. Salamander, the chemist. It's not triggered Berserk, but it does inflict a little bit of damage. Indeed, he was the bait. And Bio, though. Oh, but double kill. Perhaps not a good enough bait, though, at the second. Cavallo's on a bit of the defensive right now. But that could change in a moment. Super Magic misses. Ooh, that's a bit unfortunate right there. Geomancer goes down again. Shot. It's gonna trigger regenerator. The time might go down to Omni Blast. No, she does not. She just barely hangs on. In fact, she might just take this opportunity to heal herself right now. Let's see, Cheer does not take out either the Mystic Knight or the Priest. In fact, she just just gets flat out KO'd. See, lay on hands happens. Omni Blast. Again, does not quite take out the time age. Down goes the chemist off the bat. 
and Gio goes down. It will be a, it will be a matter of time before Kapala takes uh, round one. Tamage doesn't really care about Omni Blast at this point. She's just sitting there eating those things. Raise one does connect. Yeah, Kapala is trying to stay alive here. Ampoir does not hit the Geomancer. It's been unfortunate. Alright, there's a double kill right there. It took that much effort, though. Then Kapala is, um, I would say Kavala, I'm sorry, is, um, quite resilient, actually. His team is still trucking along, despite being at a disadvantage. Kill off that amp bio. I think, I think Kapala wants to end this right now. bit of a ruby like is why not I think now this is gonna be it really soon all right Kapala takes round one muscling through um, Kapala's defenses here We'll see what happens in round two. All right, next we go into map 10 instead of Igor's castle. Everyone's just setting up right now. So a focus strike. He's gonna poison the one of the mystic knights, but he's gonna trigger brave up too. Off. 
Lantega goes off. Hits the chemist, does not quite hit the Geomancer. Cobra Strike does hit. So let's see, the Geomancer being in range, I wonder if that means she's going to get punished. Yes, she will. She got hit by Titan and goes down. Oh, and don't act onto, uh, onto uh, Cavallo's Paladin. Not good. Yeah, this map is great for Drought and Summit. And they can just batter teams that aren't quite... Um, made to handle them. Yeah, these summon matches are becoming a little bit too much for a Cavallo to handle here. I mean, as bulky as his team is in like one-on-one -on -one scenario, I don't think it can handle that much AOE at once. If I move is right in range for double pound southern cross, taking out the Geomancer. The chemist is berserked. That's not good for Kapala at all. I think that Geomancer is just pure draw, I'm pretty sure. But regardless, she gets killed. But regardless of that, she gets killed. Cavallo is in, in, in deep, deep trouble right now. They're all getting bunched up too, which is not quite what he wants. Yeah, we're just uh, waiting for uh, the dismantlement show to finally end. Paladin's got six move and six jump, so you can just go ahead and just, like, run away. Um, but... Kapala can, can easily just catch up to him. Yeah, I think it's pretty much GG right there. And good job, Kapala. You, um, are on your way to the... Losers winner, losers finals. As you await the winner, as you wait, I'm sorry, you wait the loser of the winner semifinals. Excuse me, Kapala, your team 
was impressive and made it this far, but your journey ends here. GG.